The experiment with dried CH3 GANS powder started in March 2018 in a KFSSI research centre. The scientists mentioned that after talks from Mr. Kesh and recent teachings, they started to establish several experiments with dried CH3 GANS. One outstanding experiment was that they completely filled a dynamic system with the powder of CH3, and that's a lot, and they rotated the system with a speed of 8,000 revs per minute. The scientists said that it was amazing to feel the fields from this one, but furthermore they placed a glass of tap water beside it and they found out that in a very short time the water raised its pH level. After 12 hours the pH level was raised from 6.05, we have an acidic water in that area, to 8.05, so two numbers higher than before. They started to place the water further away, 2 meters, 5 meters and then 25 meters and the water still got influenced by the reactor. Even in a container including 40 litres of tap water, the pH level raised to nearly 8. Additionally, the scientists mentioned that they took a number of samples from soil outside the building, 5 metres away and 35 metres away, from the reactor, with walls in between, and they found out that after one week, even the soil raised in its pH level. The explanation of the scientists was that the water is very gravitational and attracts the very strong fields of the reactor very easily and so it gets more alkaline. Beside this outstanding phenomenon, they reported a problem they had during this experiment. They said that after a few, day, a few days, they had a so-called plasmatic saturation, which means that the motor stopped suddenly. By testing it with another motor, they found the same. After some days, the motor stopped although these motors run 24 hours a day for several months in all other experiments. Beside this problem, for which they will surely find it, as they stated, they summarized that this phenomenon is important for the areas of agriculture and health, and they are looking forward to experimenting further.